אז אם יש מרצים זרוע בלי אוכל, מאוד טוב, יד אוי לא, let's take some צדוקה, my dear friends, put it in together, together as I always say, the theme of hacker and nothing more powerful than good old fashioned Jewish unity. So really today is Erev Rosh Hashanah. Now you're asking me, what am I talking about? Which Rosh Hashanah exactly? I thought that uh, Rosh Hashanah passed three months ago, but by now you know that Chassidim love to have celebrations and special dates. So b- between all equals, this one is even more equal. Tomorrow, the 19th day of the month of Kislev, is by Chassidim called Rosh Hashanah Lachsidis. The Rosh Hashanah of Chassidism. What happened on this day? In 1798, the founder of the Chabad Chassidism, Rabbi Shneir Zalman of Liadi, the author of the Tanya, called the Bala Tanya, Bala Shulchanoruch, he was freed from imprisonment in Tsarist Russia. Now, this wasn't a personal uh, liberation. It was actually a watershed in Jewish history, ushering in a new era in the revelation of the inner soul of Torah. The first one to start teaching Hasidic concepts and disseminating Hasidic ideas was the Baal Shem Tov, two generations prior to the Alter Rebbe. But he only revealed certain little gleanings of the, mis- of the mystical soul of Torah. Prior to this, there was no revelation at all. It was only kept and known by the Kabbalah students, the few select Kabbalists. The Baal Shem Tov started to reveal a few of some ideas. After the Baal Shem Tov came the Maggid of Mizrich. He took it a step further and further revealed a little bit more. And in fact, it's interesting that 26 years prior to the Alter Rebbe's release from imprisonment on the 19th day of Kislev, the Maggid, whom the, Balsha, who the Alter Rebbe excuse me, considered his mentor, his teacher, his Rebbe, passed away on that day. And the Maggid told the Alter Rebbe, this day is going to be our Yom Tov, referring to the, Mitala, to the Maggid's passing and the Alter Rebbe's release of prison. But when it came to disseminating Chassidus, the Alter Rebbe went much further than the Baal Shem Tov and the Maggit. He brought these teachings to segments of the Jewish population all over Eastern Europe. And he founded the approach of Chabad, Chachma Bin Adas, understanding it in the structure intellectually study of it, not just some thoughts, but systematic learning. We have to realize that at that time, in the early years of Hasidic movement, there was a very strong and sometimes venomous opposition for the teachings and establishment of Hasidus. Even within the Hasidic community, some felt that the Alter Rebbe, Rabbi Shnei Azalmedos, went a little too far in making it available and making it so popular. So, in the year 1798, the Alter Rebbe was arrested on charges that his teachings and activities threatened the imperial authority of the Tsar. And in fact, he was imprisoned in an island fortress in the Neva River in Petapur. During his interrogations, he was compelled to present to the Tsar's ministers the basic tenets of Judaism and explains various deep concepts of Hasidic philosophy. After 53 years, uh, excuse me, after 53 days, tonight, he was exonerated of all charges and released. While he was in his prison cell, the Baal Shem Tov and the Maggid came to visit him. And he asked them, why am I here? And they responded, because this is really a reflection of what's happening in the higher worlds above. 
There was an indictment in the above world about the Alter Rebbe's disseminating these teachings. So the Alter Rebbe asked him, should I stop? And he said, not only should you not stop, but as soon as you're going to be released, you should expand further. And in fact, following his liberation on the 90th day of Kislev, he redoubled his efforts, disseminating his teaching on a far broader scale and with more detailed and down-to-earth explanations than before. So this day marks the birth of Hasidism, which we see until today, how relevant, how important it is, this teaching of Hasidism, which keeps Judaism alive today, all the way, shining the way, shining the light and the way, till the Geula with Mashiach.